What's going on, you guys? Back at you with another one. Today, we're going to be checking out a record called Hood by a guy named Colt Ford, and it's featuring Kevin Gates and Jermaine Dupri. Now, I just did a, um, uh, what's his name? Lil Dirk and Morgan Wallen song, and I was talking about how good it is to see those two worlds come together. Because I've always talked about how, like, you know, like, country white people get this bad rep for being, like, quote, racist and all this shit. But if you really think about it, like, black culture and fucking rednecks have more in common than not. You know what I mean? It's like the whole like God guns fucking d dislike of the law, fucking church, um, barbecue, dirt bikes. You know, we're pretty much like the same fucking thing besides like the, you know, to say there's not a difference makes you weird. But uh, there's a lot of bad things going on in the country that don't need to be there. So it's good seeing these crossovers. And I love Kevin Gates. He's hilarious. Uh, Jermaine Dupri is a legend. I'm not familiar with Colt Ford, but hey, let's dive into it. I'm looking forward to this. Please like the video, sub to the channel, and let's go. Hell yeah, brother. Hook a lift. Mic check, one, two, one, two. Damn, he looks young still. <laughs> I'm gonna give me a cowboy hat with this one. Uh huh. Coat, let's go. I was 17 with a bag of grain. I bought off a dude named Andre. Uh -huh. I'd roll it up and roll out of town, rocking anything from Wu. <laughs> Got that fucking Memphis bleak stab in there. Oh man, this is. I'ma give me a cowboy hat with this one. <sighs> Coat, let's go. I was 17 with a bag of grain. I bought off a dude named Andre. Uh -huh. I'd roll it up and roll out of town, rocking anything from Wu Tang to Conway. Yeah, I know what this Air is. Force Ones, alligator boots. Uh -huh. Hell, you could have found me in either of the two. Just uh -huh. a colorblind kid caught somewhere in the middle. I don't discriminate. Hell, I'm a little bit. God, liberals would lose their mind at this. Like, oh my God, are you is, are you stereotyping black people for menthols? They would lose their fucking mind. I'm sticking to my roots like Velcro Bending them strings yeah. Dropping that bass uh, And spitting them bars yeah. Here's a little taste Dude, this is fucking a beautiful record Straight up I love this This feels good This is so refreshing Yeah Shout out Kevin Gates, dude I just need to get me a big booty, bitch Put my hand in that pussy Love him <laughs> Smoking the backwoods like a fiddle. I'm Jay Z mixed with some Hank 3. Plus a little bit of redneck mother. A little bit six piece swimming in hot sauce. Little bit y'all, little bit brother. Little bit of wintergreen, little bit of menthol. Little Tennessee with some Hennessy. Call me Mr. Miss. Oh my god, are you accusing black people of drinking Hennessy? I'm offended. Understood. <laughs> I love him so much. <laughs> Wonder what he's gonna talk about. Hold up, dude. Yeah. 
trying to spin. Got a blueberry farm by the crate, by the box. If I feel like going fishing, then my lake fully stocked. Private chef, I just ate. I don't play. I go hard. Got a helicopter pad that I use as a garage. Damn. I don't discriminate. Hell. I'm a little bit redneck mother. Little bit sick. Oh man, that was fun. That was a fun record. I wish uh we make out <laughs> we made out the barn with this one. <laughs> yeah, I wish that I wish that song had more Kevin Gates on it. And it's driving me nuts, you know that stab that bring. I wonder ah, that's from like a Memphis Bleak song. Or maybe it's a Jay Z song. Oh, it's something it's some like an old Rockefeller thing. Yeah, dude, that was fun as fuck. That was a great song. When that came out two years ago, I'm surprised I never heard that. Um, yeah, I mean, without Kevin Gates, I wouldn't really like that song. But uh, you know, Kevin Gates really rounded the bases on that one. But no, that was fun. That was a good record, dude. And like I said, it's just it's just good. It's just good with all this bullshit going on, you know. The media wanting to stir everything up and fucking eh, there's all this racism shit. Like, who gives a fuck? Nobody gives a shit. It's a good way to it's a good way to get clicks and demonize people, you know, is to call them the ugly R word. But like realistically, I mean, you know, most people don't give a fuck about, you know. Anyways, please like the video, sub to the channel. That was a great time. That was a fucking hoot. Uh yeah, I'll see y'all for the next one.